Mama Dika. Manirio di Matakan, the sixth stages of the developmental model of intercultural sensitivity, also known as AMIF. Stage 1, Kanyo also known in English as denial. The individual does not recognize cultural differences. Stage 2, Bong Han, also known in English as defense. The individual starts to recognize cultural differences and is intimidated by them, resulting so either a superior view or own culture and justified high regard for the new one. Stage 3, Kanyo also known in English as minimization. The individual starts to see cultural differences, debunk more universality or ideas rather than cultural differences. Age 4, Kanyong Rap, also known in English as acceptance. The individual begins to appreciate important cultural differences in behavior and eventually own values. Stage 5, Kan Prakua, also known in English as adaptation. The individual is very open to the views when accepting new perspectives. Stage 6 Banana Khan, also known in English as integration. The individual starts to be beyond their own culture and see themselves, their actions based on multifarious cultural viewpoints. To better understand the 6 TMIS, also known as Developmental Model of Intercultural Sensitivity, Hambo Pai. Kanyo Kona, or also known in English as denial, means the individual does not recognize cultural differences. Example, people have always asked me how I survived in Philippines for a year. The answer is, it's not easy. Kabuka, I am a Thai but is living in Philippines. Why? I don't know. I just kinda like it here. Philippines and Thailand are most alike at many points. Point 1. Small grocery stores and street vendors. They are very much common in both countries, and that makes it easy to munch something on the street. Here and in Thailand are very much alike. I mean, Thai have sunny and rainy weather, and we can deny that. In 3. C. Yes, every country has it, but I'm not pertaining to that one. Rather say, people in the Philippines doesn't know how to swim, just like people in Thailand. But not all of them. So, point four. They are both Southeast Asian countries. Well, that's the obvious point. The point I've mentioned earlier are the perks, and there is nothing to worry about. I guarantee you that when you can speak the same language they speak, you'll be fine. Kanyokona are also known in English as denial means the individual does not recognize cultural differences. Example, people have always asked me how I survived in the Philippines for a year. The answer is, it's not easy. Kabuka, I am a Thai but is living in Philippines. Why? I don't know. I just kinda like it here. Philippines and Thailand are most alike at many points. Point 1. The small grocery stores and street vendors. They are very much common in both countries and that makes it easy to munch something on the street. Here and in Thailand are very much alike. I mean, Thai have sunny and rainy weather and we can deny that. In 3. C. Yes, every country has it but I'm not pertaining to that one. Rather say, people in the Philippines doesn't know how to swim just like people in Thailand, but not all of them. So, point four, they are both Southeast Asian countries. Well, that's the obvious point. The point I mentioned earlier are the birds, and there is nothing to worry about. I guarantee you that when you can speak the same language they speak, you'll be fine. Sawa di ka, di Sancho Mari, Amitia, or Giyangan ka. I'm gonna talk all about the second DMIS, which is defense. Defense is, during this stage, learn to open, feel, and through them own culture. This is only good culture. This stage open consists negative stereotyping and us to them thinking. As well as I've experienced a travel in Thailand, I really like their culture there. I love their food and traditional costumes. It's so nice to wear. 
They are so polite people and very respectful people toward each other. Lastly, that I love the most is the accept LGBT community, which is I'm very surprised about it. Because in the Philippines, if you're part of it, they make fun of you and gossip you. That's why I like this country more than mine. Kapun manaka! Some of the problem is some of the tourists are not throwing their garbage properly. So, in order to minimize it, Thailand applied the 3R strategy, which is to reduce, reuse, recycle. For maintaining the cleanliness and beauty of their tourist spots. I'm from Thailand and I migrated all over to the Philippines. I have adopted most of the culture in order to fit and be inside the community. Some examples that I have learned is blessing and then saying oh and off. We Filipinos respect the elderly by doing the Manupo Act. Oh really? I should go and do that to that grandma over there. <laughs> 